We're back here for another London High School Red Raiders ball game. We got London versus Grandview Heights. I'm here with uh, Tommy Wilson once again tonight, my old sidekick. I see Drew Porter ran to get out of the picture. <laughs> he didn't want to be no part of this thing. Uh, Tommy, uh, you want to give us a little stats on what London's coming in at? Yeah, London's coming in at 8-1, 5-1 in the BAC. Grandview comes in 7-2, 4-2 in the BAC. We got leading score for London, Sean Kahn at 17 points per game, and John Wilson at 15. Rebounders, Wilson at 8.1, and Miller, five. I got a, I got a bleep you, bet. You peed him off. Woo! <laughs> but anyway, so much for that. Uh, we're going to get back into this situation here where London run up against uh, uh, Bexley, a G. Millard coach team, and uh, they kind of got their... Uh, kind of got picked and I got a feeling Grandview is coming in here like you said at seven and two and they're going to be an equal equally uh, opponent that's going to try to do the same thing yeah. because I'm seeing they're getting they're finally catching on that this three-point shot is not the only thing that is in this game and we've re relied so much on the shot outside the arc that uh, when they shut that down uh, we had a little problems yeah Grandview comes in they're ranked 14th in the state 14th in the state, and I think, the state. I think Lennon's comes in at 6. Uh, we're also looking at a situation where uh, London finally got a high-low game going. They were down 16 points at one, at one point, and when you fight back that far, and they went up by 4, when, by the time you fight back, uh, it, it, was, it was rough to really carry yeah, it on. Uh, Carl, we're getting ready to get this game rolling here, so if you want to take it on down to the floor. Here we go, the barn burner. Yeah, we're getting ready to play a little basketball. So I'm going to let you pick up the uh, starting lineup. Okay. I was waiting to see what Mr. Parsons had to say. Got two ranked teams coming in. For the Grandview Bobcats, we got number 14, a 5 foot 7 inch senior, Brian Blake. At guard, we got number 22, Jake Larison, a six-foot sophomore. At forward, we got another six-foot junior, number 34, Brian Wendell. At forward, we got number 42, Aaron, I'm going to let you say, Trebelowitz. And at center, we got six-foot six sophomore, Matt Buddy, who leads the team in rebounding. And they're coached by Coach uh, Ray Corbett. And for the London Red Raiders. At guard, we got Sean Kahn. Sean Kahn had a relatively good season so far this year. We're looking for big things out of him. We got number 22, three point Corey Bennett. Corey Bennett was kind of shut down over there at Bexley. We had to get some picks for him today. And we got number 30, Pete Slash and Cut Rule Cave. Nice penetrator. We got Bo Williamson to help pick up some of the boards for John Wilson. And we got six foot six inch senior John Wilson. Averaging 8.1 rebounds and 15 points a game. John's been playing pretty strong there in the middle so far this year. I think they're I think the coach uh, found out that you're gonna have to go more to the inside game and less relying on the three-point shot. I don't remember actually doing that much three-point shooting against us, but they were able to, uh, just, they controlled the game, and they ran right along beside us, so the, 
must have been the, the running lions too. So now we're it's a new day. We got uh, Grand Duke Bobcats, like you say, they're coming in here ranked number 14th in the state. London's what, six? Six. So we're looking at uh, maybe some good things. We're gonna try once again to get a not so instant replay going here tonight. I'm sure Coach Corbett for the Grand Duke Bobcats. He's ready, he scouted London, and he's ready to go. Someone threw a towel up here at you. Uh, I'm, I'm seeing books and everything else come flying up here. And London controls oh. tip of Con Con. A little short jump by Wilson, and it won't go. And I feel John Wilson's the key to London. He has a good supporting cast, but like you said, they gotta get the ball inside to the big man. Right. That opens a lot of things up. From the looks of thing, I think both teams are gonna come out running. Rule K makes a good move to John Wilson, and he puffs it in. You see what he creates? And London jumps into full court man-to-man -man press. And London goes up two to nothing. London's uh, running a man-to-man -man defense here so far. Looks like uh, Grandview is coming out with a uh, 1-4, and we got a three-point shot by White, number 14. Rule K inside. He tried to get the finger roll, and it didn't go. The reverse finger roll. The reverse finger roll. <laughs> And we have a tie ball game. Uh, Grandview, like I say, is sitting up there in a 1-4. Uh, flashing out to the side. And we get a steal or Gruel K. And he gets picked. <laughs> I think Grandview can play both types of game, half court and full court. We had it, we had we got a jump ball called here. Got number. 50 Williamson, number 30, Bud, Bud. <laughs> well, you got fun with that, aren't you? Yeah. Got London still in the man-to-man -man defense. Grandview seems to be pretty patient so far. I've seen at least two or three passes, at least two or three before a shot attempt. There's nice a three-pointer. It's no good. Buddy with the rebound. They're getting too many shots. I thought Wilson should have blocked that, but he, it turned out okay. Here comes Khan shaking and baking and weaving. And he draws a foul. These referees may let him play. The referee holding the ball, he's the one that likes to call charging. Jake Larson, <laughs> yeah. That's our man. Jake Larson uh, picks up his first foul. Bennett is Bennett's top of the up key. Top, and it's good. And hit. I'm not going to talk about him reeling off four or five. Well, he came off with a double five. pick there, and that made the difference there. He wasn't getting any picks up at uh, the last game. Drew K lost control of his dribble. The ball remains. The ball was out running Gru K. Who'd he, who'd he give that to? Oh, it's London's ball. It's London's ball. London inbounds to Con. A little shake and bake, a little turnaround jumper, no good. Wilson. Wilson went <laughs> Wilson three up between his legs and make and pulls that one out of where. And Grandview takes a timeout. Nice defensive pressure by London. And we got a seven and three score here. Grandview coach isn't too happy with what he's seen so far. You have, Go ahead. You have to be ready because London's going to try to force you into that up-tempo ball game. I know we say that week after week, but the team has to be ready. They, they weren't ready, couldn't get the ball inbounds, therefore they had to take that time out. Uh, Donnie, see if you can run that back to the play where Wilson got the rebound and it come, took the ball between his legs and uh, uh, and let me know when you're ready. 
were trying to not so instant replay. That play that Wilson made there uh, looked like one of the opposing players had the ball. Somehow Wilson reached between his legs and got the ball. Are we going to get it? I think I might have waited too long. That's okay. Go ahead. Go ahead and uh, go ahead and, and uh, tape. Okay, we got Grandview inbounds in the ball. Lining with that good defense pressure. That smart move. Real smart move. Teams in man to man full court. Press, get the ball, tell everybody clear out, and you bring it down yourself. Oh, that looks like Grandview is kind of content to take those uh, three-point shots behind the arc. There they haven't been too successful so far. And Grulke makes a move to the bucket, and bad pass. We got a seven and three score. Five minutes to go in the first quarter. Things seem kind of quiet here, Tom. Grandview's only bucket comes from number 14, Brian Blake, and that was a three-point field goal. Tough early in the contest. Good drive to the bucket by number 22, Larrison, and he scores. Sean Kahn, he's fouled by the big man. He'll go to the line and shoot two. That's what you got to do to a man that's 6'6". Six, six. You got to take it to him and with make, authority. And make him commit himself. And Sean Kahn does a good job of drawing fouls once he gets in there. That's right. Have I said Sean Kahn too much? I couldn't hear you. Have I said Sean Kahn too much? Oh, no. Do whatever you want. And there, he, who made that? <laughs> Sean Conn picks up his first point, unofficially. And he's two for two at the line so far. Ooh. Grandview come down stroking, smoking. Couldn't get it to go for him. Here comes Wilson, rebound. Nice pass. Into Williamson. Rebounders, Short rebounders. Short won't go. Williamson, Wilson was playing a strong game inside. A lot of hustle by Williamson. These referees are letting them play. I they think are letting them play. That's what you got to do when you got two ranked teams, two strong teams coming in. Let them go out there and get at it. They're definitely doing that. Oh, oh. good sweet inside <laughs> move to number 30. Buddy. Buddy. Wilson gets the ball inside. Nice move. And he's fouled by Buddy. His set. That's a good move, move by Wilson. You know, I, I noticed Wilson uses the basket. He does a lot of reverse shots using the basket as another defensive mechanism to get the shot off to keep him getting blocked which a lot of players don't, don't really, they, they know it, but they don't think about that at the time. I think when he made that spin move right there, if he'd have stopped and shot the ball on the same side, be at the line with a chance for a three-point play. And he knocks in the first one. 10-7 London, 351 left in the first quarter. And he's one for two. Good hustle by uh, Williamson to try to steal at it pass there, inbounds pass. Jeremy Miller into the game for London. We got uh, London picked up a full court man-to-man -man press here. And making Grandview work. Didn't have much trouble with that one. Bucket by Larson. Larson. Rupe up top, makes a move inside, back out to Khan, and he travels. 
Drew K's got to look. When he penetrates their defense, he can go on in for a layup. Yeah, yeah, he can. <laughs> but he likes to penetrate and pass, penetrate and pass, which is good. But you got to know when to go and know when to stop and pass. You got to know when to hold and when to fold them, huh? What Kenny Rogers said. <laughs> And we got a 10-9 game now, but just a little over three minutes in the first quarter. London's playing good defense. That's what they're going to have to do. And number 22. As Grandview goes up by one. Good fake by Drew K. And that's good situation. He has to keep control of the ball and not lose it. Yeah. Miller turns around, the short jumper, gets his own rebound, he's fouled. I'm going to say this again. Do you see the way he holds that ball above his he head? He does keep he the rebounds. ball above his head. Make for a quick shot, and that way that little 5'7 guy. Can't come in there and make that little uh, speedy Gonzalez steal. Did I hear someone say C? Is C in the game? My man C, Clint C's in. C's in. Sony's in, Russell's in. We've got three new players in the game right now. Along with Miller and Williamson. And Miller misses the front end of uh, two shot fouls, Hill. We missed them both. And London down. With under three minutes to go in the first quarter, 11 to 10. Thomas been, they've been, both teams been getting up and down the floor pretty good. But the defense on both sides have been pretty strong. Yes. And I think this defense is what uh, Gus has been looking for. He made good the Good inside move, no basket, and foul is on C. C. He made the comment after the Bexley loss that London just point blank has to play defense. Well, we've been saying that all year, that any time a team scores 70 points on you, there's very little defense being played. And I noticed in that third quarter at Bexley, London really buckled down with the defense. Five. And we got a five-second call. London takes over. And there's a, there's a testament to that defense we've been talking about. Defense will get you there. Pass inside the middle, he makes a little turn. Nice Short move. jumper and go and score. You know, Jeremy's type of player, he doesn't play with a lot of confidence. Clint C was on the near steal. Near steal by Clint C. He he doesn't play with a lot of confidence. If he'd get his confidence level up, he's capable of doing great things on that basketball field. Well, he's got another year. He's a, it's his first year on the varsity. He's got another year to go, so you know. Takes time. Rome wasn't built in a day. I don't think he knows what he's capable of. He got the block. Near block by Miller. He's looking for it on a fast break and goes up and left. And he throws it in. <laughs> Tom, I think we done made the boy play harder. He done ticked him off. He done made him play harder. I know what he can do. I see him good. at the He on the floor good that time. <laughs> Offense. That's where the principal verticality comes Oh, in. no, not again. <laughs> the principal. John Wilson was straight up and down, and number 14 jumped into him. He broke that plane. But... Team fouls, that's two on London, four on Grandview. London's up 14-11. Free throw good by Brian Blake. Both teams are, look like they're under their scoring average for, for, per quarter right now. His London, game, go ahead. His game's turned into more of a half-court game for both teams. Yeah. I think a lot of that has to do with a lot of these coaches have seen how London runs. They're getting back down the floor and getting right down there with them forces into a half-court game. 
Russell makes a little juke move inside, and he's fouled. That's a good little move by Russell trying to take it to the hole. Got to the foul line, Tom went up. Somebody come from behind him, tried to make the block, and, was, and fouled him. Say Daniel looks like he's grown about maybe three inches, three or four inches in two years. He does, doesn't he? Well, if he grows to match some of his uncle's height, he's gonna be a big he's man. gonna be a big <laughs> man. Free throw was hard. You gotta stay on that line and shoot it. Watch when he shot that first one. Ball's in the air and he backed off the line. Yeah, which means he's not doing a complete follow through. There we go. I think he might have heard you, Tom. London in the diamond full court press. Nice defense. Five. Can we get a 10? And a good block by Wilson. Tony going all the way, and he's he gets rushing. Block. Block. Put it up, put it up, Harry. Uh, not Harry. Uh, <laughs> Jeremy. <laughs> Jeremy Miller goes up strong and pulls down that rebound. I tell you what, since we uh, kind of compared uh, Jeremy and his brother Harry, Jeremy's starting to play like, uh, I'm going to show you who's the best between the two of us. Shane's better than Harry. Oh, man. Now you are going to start a fight. <laughs> I'm have a coming at me. I seen Shane, he said he heard that comment also. Oh no, <laughs> I haven't seen Shane for a while. He said he's been checking the games out. <laughs> <laughs> and we had a turnover by Bexley. I'm sorry, turnover by Grandview. London's ball, Sony up top of the key. The refs are letting him play. All of a sudden get nice. through a good put it, pass. Put it up, put it up. Go up strong. Clint C. My man C couldn't make that one fall. Look, look. Come on down, Wilson, and post him up. Wilson, a little short jumper, he won't go. Clint, Clint C, C he's rebound. strong, there he is. Clint C. 17-13. London with the steal. Sony goes for three, it won't go. Put it back. C with the rebound. C was Get back that time. No, no. And score by number 34. Brian Whittle knocks that one in. This side of the game, you're running up and down, you're banging. Wilson, the quick Someone's, jumper, we ain't got much time. And it should count, it didn't go. Someone's gonna get tired. And we got a uh, first quarter score of 17 to 15. London leading, Tom, they've been getting up and down the floor. Uh, Donnie, stop your right there and go back and get that last shot attempt by uh, Russell. I'm trying to see if we can get this not so instant replay working here. And so we'll try that for as you say. Tell me when you're ready. Roll it. Roll it. Let me know when you're ready to run it. Ready? Go. Okay, and here's that pass out to Russell. A quick shot. I think we can get it done. It's just going to take a little time. It looked like he may have got fouled. It did look like he might have got fouled. You know, I think Daniel's a summer away from being able to nail those three pointers consistently. He may be about two or three feet out of his range when he's outside the arc. If he takes a step in, I think he can start putting some points on the board. Yeah, and I think a lot of it has to sometimes the, the amount of playing time you get. A lot of times these kids get in there and they say, well, I'm not going to get in that much, so I'm going to get as many shots I can get while I'm in here. And uh, if that is the attitude, oh, Wilson in for quick one. from Bennett. Puts London up by about four. Get back. Box sure. out. Bucket by Larrison. Oh, that's Blake. Blake knocks one in. 1917. And we had a good move by uh, Corey Bennett, and he's fouled going in. Chris Curry. That's 16 foul on Grandview. One more. London's in the one one. Right. 
I'd like to see us pick that up with seven minutes to go until the half. It's really a really close game here. We got uh, Bennett going to the line right now. He gets the shooter's roll and knocks down the first one. I believe Bennett's averaging about 13 points a game up to this point. And he misses the second one. Grandview yeah. makes a little penetration back up top of the key. London still in the man to man. Seeing a lot of hand checking, I say they don't allow. Who we got here? Bucket by Larison. There's a three. Scores tied. 20 to 20. Con makes a little shake and bake move inside. Can't okay. get it to roll. He got away with traveling. You got three seconds. I tell you a little secret, Tom. The type of moves that he makes, and I'm not saying he travels a lot, but the type of moves he makes to get to the place he wants to go, if you watch it closely, there's going to be a lot of traveling in, the, in those moves. That little extra shuffle step that you get him inside the big boys that referees can't see yeah. him. As he long likes. as you can do them, it's not traveling unless it's called traveling. He likes to utilize that Kevin McHale move. Coach Long tried to show me how to I can't get it <laughs> <laughs> but it looks like traveling and a lot of refs will call it that and you've got to argue your point but it works that's the best that's bottom move. line it works nice move and Locked a good by block Wilson. by Wilson Wilson Phil playing, playing really mean on the boards tonight Khan tried to make a look away pass and uh didn't quite get it to where he was trying to get it there. He had the right idea, but just two guys on his left were about a step behind him. It's called turnover. <laughs> Bucket by Carter. Chris and Carter. Grandview goes up by two, 22 to 20. Uh, under six minutes to go in the, uh, in the uh, second quarter. And Grandy's in the man to man. Okay, makes Watch move. the baby. Huh? <laughs> Helmets ran the baby over over there. <laughs> Number 14 for Grandview, Blake. He's pretty much the same type of player as Gruel K. Penetrating through the lane. Take what you can get. Wilson, Bennett missed three. Wilson with the rebound. Bennett, uh, Wilson tried to make a move on the bucket, and Bennett with the steal. Bennett with the near steal. He was hustling. Oh, he, he probably averages 10 four burns a game. Yeah. Blake. Leonard's got to box his team out because they're coming at the board. They're, they're sending out. everybody. That's right. That shot, that jumper looked like a Grulke tipped that ball. But we'll take it. They got a man right in Bennett's face. He's not going to get anything, no gimmies tonight. Three seconds on Williamson. This Grandview team, they're well disciplined. They come down, they'll make five, six passes, take their open shot, set good pitch. We got a timeout, timeout by London. Go ahead. Score 22 to 20. Grandview on top with 5.29 left in the second quarter. Drew, we got to get you on the mic. Come here. Come here. What a boy, Shy. Got Carl with the Shy, the cheerleaders. See if I can get the names here. No, I didn't say that. <laughs> Can't find them in here. What's that? I was looking for the cheerleaders. I know the seniors we got Kara Kitchen. Kara right Kitchen. Now. Carrie Murphy. Jennifer Nolan and Jessica Rhodes. I think there's another one too. 
I guess not. Okay, I'm back to the ball game. With uh, Grandview up by two, under five and a half minutes to go in his first, his first half. Good steal by Wilson. Good look away pass. Bennett for three, it won't go. You gotta hit the offensive boards. Can't get into have it one shot and the ball goes the other way. Nice. Good, pin. good show the ball fake. He was looking for a birdie and there's no one around and he didn't <laughs> have to do that pump fake. But it's a good habit to get into. Bennett for Lord three. Bennett for three. I still say we got to look inside a little more often. Nice pump fake. Good Williamson rebound by with Williamson. three rounds. That pump fake gets you a lot of easy shots. It will, it will. London with a turnover. I tell you what, uh, Grandview's cutting off that passing lane real well. Bucket by Larison. This Larison is taking it to the big boys. Oh, man. London can't get anything to go. Got a lid on that bucket. London down 26 to 20. Four minutes to go in the uh, first half. Wilson with the steal. We should get a foul here. No. We cannot get anything to fall. Go up hard. Get him. Con and one. John Con knocks one in. Twenty-six, twenty-two, and Con will go to the foul for a possible three-point play. We got Miller, Russell, and C into the ball game for Wilson, Gulke, and Bennett. Take a team like London, average height being about uh, six foot. They're not going to win many ball games half court, pushing the ball inside. They've got to get up and down the court, be able to do it both. But you know, well as I do, if you don't have an inside game, you got problems. Both teams are about average in height as far as away from what I'm seeing here. Yeah. A little short jumper. By number 14, Blake, it won't go, and London comes up with the rebound. The starting lineup, Sean Conn travel. Starting lineup, I think Grandview, London gives up a couple inches, five, eight, six, six feet. So, yeah, you're right, they're about average. And then down inside, we go six, six for Grandview, six, three. And London goes six, 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 five. 6'3", six, 6'4", six, so we're not too bad of shape. London's still in the man-to-man -man defense. See the way they're working in there, no weak side help. And Russell makes a little quick snatch out of there. He's looking for Con up top, Con for three. Doesn't Short. draw anything. And See something like that. Look the way that middle's wide open right there. Grandview's coming at us hard, 29 to 22. Clint C. Miller, short jumper, it won't go. I want you to watch the paint. Keep your eye on the paint. Watch when they bring the ball up top. Look at that. The weak side help was late. Travel. We don't have, we haven't been showing too much weak side help there at all. And that's just as much the man, the man defending the ball, defending the man in the paint, it's just as much his fault as the guy not giving weak side. When you see that ball go, you've got to holler for that yeah, weak side help. Right. And then someone's got to get there. It's a team thing, you've got to be a lot of communication between the players. That was a foul. And number 42, And I know Gustin's philosophy is one pass away denied, two passes away, your weak side. Tabilowicz picks up his first foul. Tabilowicz 
Tabilowitz comes in at 6-3. Got Miller going to the line. Miller, he, he, he's 6-3 junior. 2.21 to go in the um, second quarter. London's down 29-22. We didn't get to mention all the coaches for London. We got Gustin, the head coach, Jerry Love, assistant, Ed Maynard, and my old teammate, Darren Long. I heard that. As Miller knocks in the first of a two free throws. Can't get the second one to go. Grandview come up with the rebound. Got a half court trap, trap here. He splits it. Want to take a look at that paint again, Gary. Two men underneath ready to rebound. I think London has kind of went into uh, what I'm seeing right. It looks like a, a matchup zone that they went into. Ruke, and it won't go. We got pushing foul on Jeremy Miller. Tom, does it seem to you like we're uh, kind of taking a few ill-advised shots? I mean, shooting a little quick? It's, to me, it's nothing they haven't been doing, like you said, all year, coming down shooting like that. But if you live by the jumper. If you die by the jumper or whatever. Wilson with the steal. That's good eyes for Wilson. It's like a... Defense is back on that play. Made the steal. London couldn't convert. We've got to convert on these turnovers. London's playing good defense. Foul on Wilson. Which was a good play by number 14, Brian Brake. He didn't back off. He took it right to Wilson. He said, hey, hey big boy, either block it or take it or pick up a foul. Like I said, London is playing defense, but when you play defense like that, you give up a little, and they're giving up a little on the offensive end. But it'll come back to benefit them later in the game. I'm sure it will. Now Blake gets his first free throw. He nails them both. You gotta get the ball down low. Got Sony, we got an over and back play here. He almost got jump ball out of that. There was a questionable call there. The number 14 made contact with the ball, the over and back. Sony was got trying out to the window. Uh, set up that play. Good pass inside. Bennett picks up the foul. Got number 52. Chris Clark. <laughs> is that who it is? <laughs> who is 52? Oh, Chris okay. Carter. Chris Carter. I think it's Chris Clark. Chris Clark. That's what I did say. He graduated back in 86. Hot nine. <laughs> and London has kind of went down. They're down by 11 points now, 34 to 23. We got down. Uh, get down too far like that Tom you got to work so hard to get back that it takes a takes a lot of it out of you when it comes time to win the game at the end of the game three point by Sony it's up good. And in. London's still the man to man nice fake Still by Grandview. Sony comes and back he at to it. Make the save. You know what I like there? When he tried to make that save, he threw the ball away from, from the basket. basket. And 500 feet in the air. Yeah, he hit the speaker up there. <laughs> Coach Nance. Which is I, the way it should be done. See, Coach Nance didn't like that too well. It's like about a $400 speaker. Oh, Lord. Five, five. Oh, <laughs> Guke gave him the shimmy. He got sandwich. <laughs> and he's like, who me? Brian Blake. <laughs> he's not, he's only five foot seven. He got sandwich in there. We lost him there for a second. <laughs> Guke stuck him with that elbow. 
looks like something I'd do. I believe that. <laughs> you was a dirty player. Still am. Oh, Lord. <laughs> 55 seconds left, London down by eight. Wilson with the rebound. Finger roll. roll by Wilson. See, that's one thing I can do is finger roll. And, and a block. block. He's it on both ends, Tom. Look, he's telling you ain't getting out of here, baby. Don't bring that <laughs> stuff in here. Wilson's doing it on both ends. He's going to take it at him again, and he's fouled by Bennett. It's Bennett, son. He's hustling. This turned into a heck of a ball game here. Makes for a heck of a ball game. 14's not going back down. You know Wilson's not going back down. We got a game. We got 38 seconds to go, and London down 34 to 28. 38 seconds to go in the second quarter. And we got Blake at the line shooting the one and one He's a feisty little, I'll oh, say yeah. feisty young man. Yeah, he is. Yeah, I had somebody tell me, I have a habit of calling them kids. Somebody said, they're not goats, call them young men. That's what I was going to say, feisty little kids. I say, feisty young man. Bennett makes a move to the bucket, inside the way. That's what right we need. Up inside, outside, inside game. Look, we got Iceman down there refereeing. Look at him. <laughs> Ice will tell him what it's all about. Looking like John Travolta. 20 seconds left. 30, <laughs> go ahead. Coach Corbett for Grandview and Coach Gustin, both shouting instructions to the teams. Let's see if we get something in the paint here by Grandview. They're coming. Nice switch. Six seconds. Fouled by Sony. Sony. Sony's only like about five foot eight two, so he we gives up quite a few inches out there. Play good defense for 16 seconds, and you give up the foul. Four seconds to go in the first half. We got a 30, 34. Have you added up yet? Have you added up yet? London's made a nice run down by four. And, and this is great going in at, at halftime with the, you know, only down by four or five because anything under double digits, you don't have to work that hard to, uh, you're still really tight in the game. So I say, anytime you got there and play hard defense, you'll benefit from it sooner or later during the game. And we have a five point game here. Four seconds to go. London ball. Uh. Got substitution. Get up there. <laughs> Boy, Got to shouting instructions to his players. Got a four second play here. Justin's got his shooters into the game. Two seconds all the way. It won't go. It won't count. It went, but it didn't count. That was quite a play. Close. Stop that, Tom. Donnie, and run that back. And we'll pick it up right after the half. Tom, we got a five-point game here. Uh, this game could go either way. London, I'm sure Gus is going to go in there at halftime and uh, make a few changes, but uh, I don't know really what changes he can make. Team playing good defense. They got to come out, get their shooting percentage up. Grandview, they're getting the ball inside, playing good defense also. They're only up by five. London's played, I'd say, poor offensively. They're only down by five, so we come yep. out, shoot the ball a little better. We'll be all right. I think one thing we're doing is we're concentrating on the uh, offense so much, on the defense so much that it's wearing you out. I tell you what, when you play defense that hard, it is hard. You, you wore out, and when it comes time to take that shot, you're going to be off. Your time is going to be some off, and it's yeah. something that you have to balance it out. Uh, do we have the stat scores yet? We'll pick them up right quick here. And uh, Tommy, go ahead. Okay, for London, we have Wilson with 10, Con with 4, Williamson with 2, Bennett with 4, Sony with 3, C2, Miller 5, and Russell 1. Gruke has yet to score in the ball game. We got Blake with 16 for Grandview, Larrison with 11, 
Buddy with two. Is that Buddy? Am I saying that right? Yeah. Wendell with two, and Chris Carter with four. Which brings us a score of 30 to 35. Are you ready to roll that? We'll, we'll go off here at the halftime with uh, this lad, a pin A in it, but it didn't count. Well, Tom, we got about a minute and uh, <laughs> 10 seconds to go before the uh, third quarter gets underway. We give him the uh, halftime Donato's wrap up there. We got Wilson leading London with 10 points. We got Blake and uh, La Larison with 16 and 11 respectively for uh, Grandview. So, uh, that's the unbelievable stat right there. Grew K. Grew K with no points no so point. far. That's unbelievable. Right so, like we say, we went back. He's playing a lot of defense. And if I sound like I'm out of breath, I am. <laughs> I had to run downstairs. But uh, we're getting ready to start the second half. 35 to 30. London's down by five. These two teams match up with one another well. They really do. And both teams are going at each other hard. Uh, like we say, London comes in here, I believe, what, sixth in the state? And uh, Grandview comes in 14th. So they've got something to prove anyway. And the referees are letting them get at it. I tell you what, they've been playing pretty Pretty solid ball. It's not been dirty, but it's been hard, a hard fought game. London's still in the man to man. <laughs> and we got a foul on Jake Larison. Larison picks up his third, and it's the team's first in the uh, second uh, half. A little quick and move inside to Wilson. Bennett for two. It and he's fouled. He may get to go to the line and shoot three. Let's we'll see what the referee is. Okay, he's saying he was on the floor. I thought we was going to get to go through the free throw line. I did too there for a moment. Grandview in the man-to-man -man also. Nice high-low. He knocks it in. And Tom, I believe that we've got to do a, a lot more of that. Get the big men into the ball game. It's like a little carrying action there. Travel. And there was no reason for that because there was no pressure on him. It looked like they were very patient with that move situation there and uh, all of a sudden they come up with a travel. See one thing London is doing, they're cutting that middle off now. And London's down 32 to 35. They're denying and working in the post. They're looking more inside to uh, Williamson and he makes a move to the bucket and draws a foul. And we got a foul on Aaron Trebilowicz. I really think when Williamson gets the ball in that close, I would be trying to go up with it. He's a strong young man. He likes to square up with his elbows out. Nice move. Can't get it to fall. Drew K. Get in. On the board. That's the one we was looking for. London picking up full court. Back to half court, man to man. They're flexing it. Bucket yeah. by right out. Buddy. 
And we got a four, three point game, 37-34. Huke. Huke once again, and it won't go. Over the back. We get over the back by number 30. Buddy. Buddy. That's his second. Third team foul. It's three on the six, six, seven. Keep going here. Maybe we can get in the foul shooting situation here early in the, in the game. And Wilson. Wilson knocks that one in. That was nothing but net. Five. See, Lund getting weak side, getting that weak side help. Lund has got like, putting a good pressure defense on. So Augustus said the team had to do was play defense, and we're right in this ball game. We're down by weak one side. Point. There's the cutter. Over to. Should have been over the back call. <laughs> Good move by Kruke. <laughs> Look at Moxley. <laughs> He's going wild down there. He traveled. He traveled. His, shoe, his shoes are squeaking. Can we zoom in on Moxley's shoes? <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> Sitting on the end there. <laughs> Good Wilson. Pass into Wilson. That's what we got to do. Good move. John Wilson for two more. Wilson's got a good, quick drop step through the bucket. We got a five-second call. That's about two or three of them so far we've had tonight, Tom. Defense. Give me. Square Wilson, up. once again, he squares nice up. Nice move. And Wilson's taking over inside. And that's exactly what I've been saying all along. We've got to go to that inside game. Now, if you watch, Tom, it'll open up that outside game here in a little bit. It'll make it a lot easier for the, the and guards. we got to shine out by Grandview. we got a ball game. London's up by 3, 40 to 37 with 4.45 left in the, uh, in the uh, third quarter. Defense does it. I'm, I'm saying it over and over again. Defense does the trick. You give me five guys on the floor, play hard-nosed defense. I'll take them any day over five guys out there that just want to come out and shoot the three. Yeah. And I'll beat you. That, well, <laughs> it, you know, defense wins in about anything you, that, that you do. you got to have a good, solid offense, but if your defense isn't there, uh, it just don't work. And I think London's defense came alive in the third period of the Bexley game. I think we're going to be seeing a lot more of this defense. Hey, Tom, they've been sticking these people. They haven't been able to move. Five seconds. We've had, what, two or three five-second calls? Yeah. And close to ten. Close to a couple ten-second violations. So, I mean, that's well-played defense. And another thing I like is we got Wilson because Wilson has stepped up. He stepped up to uh, trying to be a go-to man. And, so far, I really didn't know who our go-to man was, but I really think it's Wilson inside yeah. if they look for him. Another five. And we got another I don't five. Think he, he got it in time. He got the timeout. Oh, he got a timeout. I think it might have worked if London's coach hadn't jumped up. London's coach kind of <laughs> jumped up and was hollering five, and I, it looked across the, the kid looked across the floor and seen it and called a timeout. Yeah. Let's Clark Kellogg say sometimes you got to do what to the referee? <laughs> You got bark to bark to the officials. <laughs> Let me know when you got it. Got a good shot of the uh, Grandview cheerleaders. Got Coach Love out on the floor. He was giving last minute instruction, Coach Maynard. Tell you what, so far this has been a very hard fought contest. We've had about probably four or five lead changes. And as right now, London is up 40 to 37. 
with 4.45 left in the third quarter. A lot of basketball yet to be played. London still in the man-to-man. -man. They played man-to-man -man the whole ball game. And it's working. Now we're getting good weak side help. Good See what it does. by Sony and toss to the back at follow, and follow gets it. Foul. And one. It should count. Nothing. Tom, should that count? Yes. He counted it. Now that's a continuation. No, it's not. Tom, he <laughs> grabbed him before he went up for the shot. <laughs> he was in the process. Donnie, did you get that? Uh, run that back for me. Let me know when you got it. That's and Sean, one all night long. Sean goes to the line uh, with a chance for a three-point play. We got not so instant replay on that We're one. We're trying. London's up by five, 42 to 37, with 420 left in the third. Roll it. Here it is. Oh, got, a little bit too late. And we got a we got a coaches conference. Back it up a little bit farther. Back it up to where he's coming down the floor. Okay, let it roll. Tell me when. Now, when everybody watch the ball when this foul goes. Watch the ball when he's fouled. Here he come. Now watch. watch this. Right, there, right, right there. Right there. Okay. Okay. And one. I'd say that's probably a pretty good call. And back to the game. You make the call. <laughs> <laughs> you make the call. You getting good on that instant replay, Donnie? Is it? That was good. That was good. Wilson's really working in the post. Get around. Love it. Love it. London's kind of took control of this game. Here comes Flatten Tom. it out. Flatten it Pushing out. Pushing the issue, and he doesn't quite get uh, He had men that opened to his right, 43. Well, I think he made the right move. Well, maybe not because you got uh, Sony coming in between them trees. He had a mm -hmm. heck of a job to try to finish that off. Had it. He got the ball. You got a split second to make that decision, so it's hard to knock somebody from making a bad pass. Inside to uh, Williamson, and it doesn't quite get the shot up. 43 37 London. Under three and a half minutes to go in the. Number 52 for Grandview. He's a strong offense. Yes. We got an offensive call there. Donnie, stop that one. Chris Carter, his second foul. Chris Carter's a pretty tall kid. Six foot, uh, young man. Six foot five. He turns around, he squares up, and he pump, but he pump fakes, but he's open. He needs to go ahead and shoot the ball. Okay, up the top of the key. Travel. And we got to travel. Let me know when you got it. Group case type player, get the ball to your point guard, which is Sony, on the floor. Here's that play again. Let it roll, Donnie. Inside. See, he could have went there straight up with the could've shot. Went straight up. Okay, back to the game. Good play, Donnie. Good play. Oh, Wilson with the block. And, and another, another block. one. And Oh, that was all ball. Is Adrian Terry in the house? Okay, run it back. Uh -huh. Is Adrian Terry on the floor? Is Adrian Terry on the floor? That looked like a good block. <laughs> we got two blocks right there. I thought Adrian Terry was back. Can we get, Carl, can we get on box? Tell me when. <laughs> <laughs> he misses the first. Ready? Okay, here we go. Here's that play. Watch this block. Oh, he's still stuck on the pump fake. <laughs> <laughs> Moxley, we're back to Carl. Moxie's been a supporter for what, 20 some years? Uh huh. <laughs> Oh, and cheese bucket, cheese bucket. 
Yeah, he, he was uh, picked fan of the year there at one time. Nice pass, Dave. Let's move in to win. Wilson, and he can't, and it, two tries and it won't go. You know. Go ahead. John Wilson's quicker than he thinks. It, it seems he does a fundamental move there, but I tell you what, he reminds me of a young a man, not no young man anymore, uh, Dick Minner. Had a step where you could throw the ball into him, he could take and wrap his foot around you, and uh, before you knew it, he didn't step behind you, and you didn't even know it, and make that and make that move. Yeah. That's, I noticed John does a step similar to that. He's got a quick first step to get him to the bucket, but he's getting there so fast, he, he's stepping, and he's on the other side. He doesn't realize it until he goes to look up, and then he shoots and puts a spin on it. We don't talk about this much, but I think John Wilson is a four-point student. Good steal, and we got a shot by Russell, and it won't go. Lennon's ball off the drool catch. If he takes a step in, he's shooting it instead of pushing it. If he takes that one step in. And that's called shooting inside your range. Uh-oh. Good rebound. This Williamson's come out to play ball now. 45, 43 to 38, London. Sony and Sony and we're going back to this outside shooting that's not what got us here under two and a half minutes left in the third quarter oh no wonder he doesn't shoot it straight <laughs> <laughs> and there's a lot going on down there and I don't know what to call them. they call it Grandview's ball <laughs> We got Bennett into the ball game for Drew K. It's getting a little exciting, Tom, and it's also getting a little rough. Lennon's done a good job of keeping number 14 and for Grandview, Brian Blake out of the ball game this second half. We got a three-point try there. Harry's got the rebound, too, as I talk about him. You got a box a player like him out. You got to box everybody out, especially a player like and Get it out of here. Well, don't bring that stuff in here. <laughs> we'll see if we got that one. We'll bring that back to you here real quick here in a minute. <laughs> Don't bring that stuff in here. Grandview's ball and the near. We got one there. Grandview's people are crying. They want to foul on Sony. London's up on him. He traveled. Hey, he traveled. Roll it. And here's that block by Wilson. Number 52, he has to be a you're, what you're doing is young you're going player. Too soon. You got to go back a little bit past, farther past it. So He's a genius. <laughs> Corey Bennett. This is the three. Number 14, Blake takes it to the bucket and he's fouled. Who they call that on Wilson or Bennett? I Foul missed on that. Corey one. Bennett. We got some bugs to work out in this. We've got a couple of not so instant replays going for us, but uh, um, it's not working out too bad. And he misses Carl, the first Carl thought we was talking about him. He put on his headphones. He taped his microphone down tonight, too, didn't he? Yeah, that's sure did. I ain't, I ain't taking a chance on knocking that microphone on the ground no more. I thought he wasn't going to come tonight. He <laughs> had to work. Break my microphone, I won't come no more. He hits the second. Score 39 to 43. Sean Conn for three. It's up. And, and nothing man. but net. That's confidence there. And we got a barn, what they call a barn burger going here, Tom. A little short jumper. Flatten it out, take it down. Russell with the rebound, kicks it out to Khan. Khan on his knees makes a good pass. That's got to go in. Russell, Russell that's strong and it's good. Yeah. OJW timeout. And London's trying to make a big run. They've had about a oh, that broke it. 
48 by Chris 41. Carter. Nick Lennon had about an eight point run there, Tom. Yeah. Con a little show fake inside with the trees. Can't get the rope, Knocked but bam, run back up with it. Get up. Get another trap. Get back, Daniel. Box out. Now we're getting into the up-tempo ball game. Yeah, that was a good move by Wilson not to try to block that because we're going to need him down the stretch. 50 to 43, close to 10 seconds left in third quarter. Good move by Wilson. He makes it. What about that move, Tom? I like a nice soft touch. This inside game has come alive, and I love it. Oh, yes. Yes. At the end of three, London 52, Grandview 43. And now I tell you what, this inside game, that's one thing I had against the three-point shot because it just took away from the inside game. But uh, tonight we're seeing both more inside than we are outside, and I love it. I, to me, that's basketball. Uh-oh, Tom pulled his tickets out. Two, three, nine, eight. <laughs> You ain't won nothing. <laughs> I'm 70. I'm 86 people off. <laughs> hey, Sonny, did you win? Ask Sonny if he yeah, won. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> and we got a good close-up of Grandview's bench here. And we got a good close-up of London's bench here. We got you done. I got Don McNeil, my son, doing the not so instant replays. Uh, we still got some kinks to work out, but uh, we're going to get <laughs> it together. He's done a good job. We're going to get it together. I'm going to say this one more time. What are you going to say? I'm impressed with London's defense. I hear you, what you're saying. You've got to be impressed because you haven't seen them play it yet. It's the first time you've seen them play it. They're playing, I mean, if they were playing it all year, good. tonight is exceptionally well. And I can see Gustin in practice now, intense, going at it. This game, it's going to get close near the end. Mark my word. Well, I'll tell you something. A lot of teams that run, that's all they do in practice is run. And if you run four days a week and then play Friday and Saturday, when it comes time for game time, you are wore out. There's got to be a break in there where you get the chance to press. And Sean Kahn goes in and... Oh, we got offensive foul on time. You know where you get your break at, don't you? Tell me about it. Right here, right now, when that ball stops. <laughs> <laughs> so oh, he traveled first. When you're a running team like that, though, Tom, <laughs> I tell you what, you got to be in super, super shape. Yes, you do. And the coach has got to stay on top of you every minute to keep you running from one drill to the next. Just to keep nice move. Fake move, and he's going. He can do it all night, Tom. <laughs> That's what I've been looking for, the inside game. He used the pump fake, try to get a little birdie action. Now what he can do if he has to, Foul he have Wilson. a shot there, Tom. He can make that little pump fake, and he's got somebody on him. As usually people want to drop back on him, he can pop it back out for the people on the outside yeah. shot. That's three on Wilson. Oh, they got walkie-talkies. Gary and Donna. I got to have some communication with my not so much replay man. <laughs> that ball went through five hands. Foul on Wilson again. He picks up. And he's not too happy with that call. He picks up two fouls in 20 seconds. That gives Wilson four fouls. I can see why he's not too happy because he was hit three or four times before it got to him. Hit before he got his chance to hit back. And he was definitely barking at the official. He didn't like that call at all. Got Williamson into the game for Wilson. Williamson enters the game with eight points. Drew K. Good move, good recovery by Wilson. It was not such a good catch, but he recovered, 
was able to go ahead and knock it in. 56-47 London. Nice crossover. And another Drew steal. With the steal. Comes up. He's pushing Not the pass. That was a sweet pass by Khan that time. And you know that why that was a foul? Tell me why it was a foul. <laughs> the referee wasn't in position to see the front of the play. That's one of them ones where referees behind you, he just sees you reaching in. Uh -huh. Looks like he got all ball. I heard that. Did you have that? Run it back. Oh, you're going to put me on the spot. I'm going right? to put you on the spot if I can. Looks like. And Bennett sinks. Front end of a two shot foul. First of all, that instant replay, I want you to look at the position of the official. <laughs> <laughs> then I want you to check handball contact. And he's two for two at this on this situation. And London's up by 11 now. With under six and a half minutes to go, London's up by 11. This defense is sticking, Tom. It's sticking, I tell you. I feel the referees are doing a fine job in this game. Yeah, they're letting them play, and they're not getting out of control. They're, 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 Good fle defense. They're, they're flexing it on them. Good inside move. Okay. And blocked by Ruke. Okay, here we go, Tom. Here's that play. We didn't get a sit. We went too Our quick. Ball. Like I said, all ball. It looked like all ball. <laughs> Run it back one more time. Can't you take my word for it? Take it back. <laughs> clear to the spot before he went across half court. And we're going to the foul line with number 22, Jake Garrison, Larison shooting. And he makes the first one. 553 left. Are you ready? Lining up by 10, 58 to 48. Tell me. And he makes them both. Okay, hold on for that. Here we go. We got Con Bennett with a three-point attempt. And it's nothing but okay. iron. With the rebound. Larison. All right, we got the foul. Off the foul. And, number and here's that play, Tom. Here we go. What's the official? All ball. All over his arm. All over his arm. <laughs> Good Lord. like all <laughs> ball, none but ball. Has a good acting job. <laughs> we got Williamson, Groove K, Bennett, Khan, and Miller into the ball game for London. Pass, a good look away pass by Ruka and Williamson should be really knocking down a few points tonight. If you like How many Williamson got? 60 to 49, London. If you let Gruke dribble and look, he'll rip you apart. I like that. <laughs> I, I think he's one of the best ball players on that team. All around ball player. He can dribble, he can shoot, he can pass, he can jump. I mean, he can do the, he's, he's a complete package almost. Say Williamson's got 12 points so far. Five minutes to go in, uh, and a steal yeah. by Gruke. He's going to slam. Oh, oh almost. <laughs> I tell you what, Tom, if he wasn't looking back to see where the other player was, I think he just slammed it. He went out with it. I'm just glad to see him get the two. Now he can swim. I've seen him do it. He's getting ready to flush out when it didn't work. Foul on Miller. Send Buddy to the line. Shooting two. Oh, Gruke. My fault. You gonna run that? You gonna run that dunk back? Which one? The dunk. Tim, can you get back to your dunk attempt? To the near dunk. To the Let's near dunk where Gruke went in for that. And see how much hang time he had up there. Yeah, we'll the check rim. out the hang time. Let me know when you got when you're ready. That might have been too far back. And 
And we got a score of 62 to 49 with 4-4-4 left in the fourth quarter. How about that, Tom? Paul acts like he's getting tired. He probably is. He had to work about 6 o'clock tonight. He's over here telling us them OJ jokes. <laughs> <laughs> and Russell sits up outside, up front to Sony. Bennett's got a free one there. And it won't fall. Wait, man, it likes that crowd right okay. there. Okay. Don't worry about it. Got Andre, Andre Napper caught him. No, that was Jamel. Defensive lineman for the football team. Oh, nice ball control yeah. by Eric Labeo. Labeo. The foul, LaBelle. Running up by Tim, the 413 left. A lot of time remaining. We got a 62-42 score, Tom. Like you said, London's up by 10. 413 to go. Sony goes to the line. We haven't yeah, called in the, the franchise this evening, have we? I sure haven't. We got caller in the ball game. I want to tell all these folks to a good one. Try to get out here for uh, there's going to be a couple games where Donato's is going to have a shootout where they give uh, $50 away for somebody to make a half court shot and uh, pizza parties for people who make uh, layups and foul shots. And I know for sure they're going to have one when the Madison Plains comes in, I believe, around February 2nd or 3rd. So uh, you might be come out here and be drawn out of the stands and uh, get a chance to win you some money. <laughs> be a sellout, that Plains game, won't it? Oh, yeah. It'll definitely be a sellout. A lot of hustle in there. And Coach Corbett wasn't too happy with that call. Daniel's playing serious past few ball games. We got Russell at the line shooting one on one. Not that he doesn't play serious every ball game. He's got a lot to learn. And he's got time. Like I say, he's only a junior. Yeah. He's got an uncle they call Junior. And he yeah. was one heck of a ball player. Yeah. If he comes up to the stands of any of his uncles, I tell you what, London's looking, got something to look forward to. He missed the second. And he went... Uh, scoreless at the foul line that time. Nice cover down, Good Daniel. Good steal by Daniel. I like that terminology, cover down. Cover down. Cover down, win socket, cover down. <laughs> and we got color in the game. Good pass into Wilson, and he's knocked down. I tell you what, John is really working hard to get positions, establish his position in the post there. Yes, he is. We got a whole team coming in here. <laughs> I seen Gus. I seen Gustin down there. He just took it all away. <laughs> you, 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 you. <laughs> Next dead ball. 64, 63 to 54. London up by nine with three, one, three left in the game. And back in the game we have Miller, Ruke, Bennett, Wilson. And Khan. Look, Gruel case trying to figure out who's who's got who. Ain't that what I said? Yeah, okay. I was just corrected by uh, my one of my cameramen it says three thirteen, not three one three left in the game. <laughs> Shows they're on the ball. <laughs> And Wilson 
can get some breather. And Williamson, who has given some super quality minutes off the bench, is back in the game. 65-54, London 11, up by 11, 3, 13 left <laughs> in the game. What we got? We got a hold on Groove K. That may be his fifth. Groove K fouls out of the ball game with how many, Drew? With five points. I tell you what, his points is not showing, you know, a whole lot, but I tell you what, he is really contributing in other ways. Block shots, uh, dishing the ball, super defense. Yeah. Uh, he's played one heck of a game as Russell comes in to replace Groove K. He had five points, but like you said, defense, he plays it. They've all played it tonight and played it well. I'll tell you what, this game is far from over because this uh, Grandview team didn't get number 16 for nothing. They can light him up. London's up by 10 right now, 65-55. And that drops it to nine. Single digits. Coach Corbett for Grandview, he's not going to let his team give up. I'm sure they're not going to give up. I know, that's right. Now they're coming with a full court pressure. Nice skip. Offense. <laughs> I see you stick that elbow out there on that spin. <laughs> you reckon his grandpa taught him that move? No. <laughs> his dad can throw some mean bows. Oh, his dad, he's uh, <laughs> I really like his dad in softball. He's got some moves in softball that make you sit and watch him. I think, he re I think he retired from basketball. Now I always see him riding no, that motor. He's too old. <laughs> <laughs> I always see him riding that motorcycle around. He's Hells Angels. Okay, we got a quick one in yeah. here by number 40. Eric LaBeo. LaBeo scores that one. He's cutting into that lead, Tom. 248 in the game. Left in the fourth quarter, 65-58. Seven point ball game. And we How got John, seven point. Are you checking my math? We got Wilson back <laughs> into the ball game with. You have to check your math. You got a calculator sitting right there in front of you. With how many fouls? Four fouls, Drew? Thank you, sir. Jeremy Grace into the game. Square up. They got him in that trap. Press and Daniel breaks it all by himself. Good move, Wilson. Pulls up. Beautiful. Two. That's called the two-foot jump stop shot. Straight, Straight up and down. Straight up and down. And I think we got him into a frenzy now. There's a little bit of panic and it looks like going on. They're looking at this score. This clock's getting down to two and a half minutes. Now's when you find out where the composure of the His, team is. They're arguing the call. I think Grandview's man may have been out of bounds when he touched the ball. I tell you what, uh, Corbett was really barking at the official that time. He was giving him, he was giving him the, he's still on him. So therefore, London gets the ball out. Russell the inside to Wilson. Inbound. And we got a good play by number 32. Jeremy Grace knocks that ball out of bounds. Russell Back in the middle. Top. Inside to Wilson once again. Good there move it by is. Wilson. He's strong. And one. And it counts. Yes. And one. Yes. That's how you play with four fouls. Let's uh, see if we can get a look at that and see how you... Uh, uh, turn to make make that quick turn to the basket there. Don't forget the pump fake. And yeah, and the pump fake, <laughs> and go up with authority. Talk to me, Donnie. So 
a lot of people don't use it. And Wilson makes a chance for three, and Wil Wilson up. Oh, and it should have been a foul. Okay. A lot of players don't use that pump fake. They watch Michael Jordan, them guys go straight up with it. Right. With that pump fake. And we'll get a look at that here in just a minute. Gets you a lot of easy buckets. And a good rebound by rebound. Williamson. Khan comes down to four, splits two players, and we get a foul. Are you ready? Let's take. Huh? Let's take a look at this. All right. We're going to have to go back even further than that point. We've got to go back maybe two or three seconds because what? by the time I'm getting it, he's already shooting the ball. We're not seeing how what let him into it. We got LaBelle into the ball game four, Run number 32. And we got Grace. Go ahead. We got Khan going to the line. 159 left, London up by 10. Uh, and Williamson, I tell you what, Williamson's playing like a man possessed underneath that bucket there now. He yeah. has really been the, the lift for London tonight. Player of the game. Player of the game. Hey. There's that pump fake, that good old pump fake. <laughs> hey, been watching Con, ain't he? Uh-oh, he had time. Wouldn't go. And we got a foul. We got Wilson. Wilson's out, fouls out of the ball game with. How many fouls? Wilson played a well of a ball game. Really has. He fouled out. Best one I've seen him play all year. 123 left in the game. London up by 10, 71 61. 26 points, Wilson fouled out. 26 there. points. He's playing a whale of a game. And we got 71 to 63. Eight point ball game. Eight point ball game. What is that? Three possessions? Three with the three. Got a stiff press here by Grandview. Franchise, he, he's able to stick in there, draw the foul. He's going through the line. Now we got to step up. Now we got to step up to the line, hit both free throws. Now is when you really need those free You need them the whole game, but now is when you really got to make them count. I'm not going to say it. I'm going to let you say it. What am I Gu supposed to say? Gus has been preaching it. This team tonight has done what it needs to do to be a successful and a powerhouse. You're going to let division. me say it? Yeah, say it. What they got to keep doing? Get more points than the other team. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay. Yeah, he's playing good defense tonight. We've been fussing about it. I'm glad to see he's getting it, got his point across to him. And then Rebound by the shortest man on the field. Oh, what's he going to call? All right, London's ball. Still an eight-point ball game. I'm waiting on Coach Long to get up and start hollering something. Where Good move. Man? Oh, didn't go for him. That was almost too easy, Tom. Too much English. Eight-point ball game. And they threw the ball away, oh. and London wasn't able to capitalize on it. Corey Bennett almost got to it. And uh, he's trying to keep him going out of bounds and lost control of the ball. Watch the three. Watch the three. They've got to shoot the three. And once again, the franchise. Can hold on to the rebound. He's trying. 50 seconds left in the game, 71-63, London. Come on, London. Oh, 
And we got a foul on number 42. Sabilowitz, his third. Grandview passed up a couple easy twos. To go, going to the line. To go for the three. And come away with nothing. No threes, no twos. Got Miller at the line. Get the roll. Miller gets the roll. Soft touch. Go ahead. You wait. His senior year. We'll be waiting. And Miller's two for two this, this trip. And I think Grandview right now is kind of playing out of desperation. I think they kind of sense a loss here. I really think he can warm up the bus now. Oh, they probably already got it started. Good move by Khan. Flagrant. Foul. Should have been a flagrant foul, but I don't think he'll give it to him. And we got the fans filing out. 24 seconds left. 73 63. Look, we got the baby on the floor again. Look, mom's on the floor. That baby's on the floor again. <laughs> ten Williamson. seconds. London's up by ten, and we got another foul by number thirty-two, Jeremy Gray. Seventy-three, sixty-three, with eight seconds left in the fourth period. Tom and London's going to boost their record to nine and one. Impressive victory tonight against the 14th ranked team in the state. Well, we really seen something that really made me happy. We was able to pull this thing out. We seen, we got the chance to see London really buckle down and play some defense. You know, people's gonna watch this, they're gonna say, if they say defense one more time. I don't care. <laughs> I don't care, and that's the game. 73 to 66, London comes up victorious, Tom. And like I say, I'm gonna say it one more time. The key to this game was what? Defense. Or the team. The big team.